you're watching this video, that means I'm back. What's up guys, it's Afro Ninja here, and this was a video that was requested um, a little while ago. It's just a let's play of the Dragonborn DLC for Skyrim. And as I went to make this the first time, my computer broke. Which kinda sucks. Because, you know... That means I can't record videos, I can't get them edited, I can't get them posted for you guys. So, that's what was happening uh, for the little, like, the few weeks that I was gone on YouTube. I hadn't been posting any videos. I posted one, but that's because I was using Jewboy Dovahkiin's computer. Shout out to him. So, yeah, so this video is Skyrim Dragonborn Let's Play, and it'll probably be part one. This DLC is... A little long for just one part unless you guys have like four or five hours to sit down and really watch this but um, I'm starting it with my chick character she is a really low level she's like level 20 I don't use this character a lot but I needed a vampire imperial so yeah level 24 level 24 doesn't have a lot of gold I know some people were having this like gold war in the comments it was really funny I only carry 4,000 gold with me. I have like millions stacked up in savings throughout my various houses. So no, I don't just have 4,000 septums. It's just what I carry with me. Like if I was going to be mugged, I would rather have like a wallet with $20 and my ID, maybe my debit card, instead of like my wallet, my debit card, my social security, my actual other debit card. Um more money than just twenty dollars like just being mugged would suck in general but I would rather have little on me than a lot so I don't know what I'm doing right now this is my vampire that's why her health and everything regenerating and I know I already said it was a vampire imperial and I haven't played this game I just got done playing Dead Space 3 just finished it. Wonderful story, so I'm not quite used to the controls in this. And it looks like I had just joined Dark Brotherhood with her. So, I am going to do some Dark Brotherhood objectives until the courier finds me and gives me the Dragonborn quest. And I'm not, I don't think I started Hearthfire with this. So, maybe we'll be getting something about that as well. But we'll find out. So, some of you may know, some of you may not. Uh, I actually just got a partnership with Zoom in Games on YouTube. Um, they'd approached me about a week or two ago and been like, "Hey, we really like the videos you're putting out. Um, check your requ check the requirements we ask, and then apply for a partnership. We want to give you one." And so I sat down, I checked everything out, and did some research, made sure they're a good network to partner with and so I partnered with them and yeah so I now am partnered with Zoom and Games, Zoom and TV Games I guess it is Zoom and TV Games on YouTube and Zoom and so TV I believe is the other site but I'm partnered with them this is gonna be fun they're gonna they're gonna be promoting some of my videos here and there and also uh, getting me more money than YouTube was getting me anyway but I'm not in this for the money I actually started this to make videos to entertain people and so that is what I'm here to do I'm trying not to drop off that wall because if I lose any health I'm not gonna get any back so oh and I'm using what is this sword? isn't this sword or sword? If you've played Dawnguard, um, if you pick the vampires, you don't, like, you can buy crossbows still or find them off of the bodies of Dawnguard people, but if you pick Dawnguard, you can actually make the crossbows, you get blueprints for enhanced Dwemer crossbows that ignore 50% of armor, as well, you can also craft arrows that will explode with fire, frost, and electricity, it's actually really cool, if you guys want to see a video on it, let me know and I will make one. But it's actually pretty cool what it does. Um, 
Okay, so this does absorb health, magic, and stamina. I'm not here. It's a potion, because I'm lazy. Poo poo. Okay, so I don't know where it is that I'm going. Oh, that's an Imperial soldier, so that's one. Personally, I like the Stormcloak side of the story more. Um, one of those reasons being you get awesome titles. Like I don't, I don't know exactly what the titles are right now. But you'll be walking past the Stormcloak dude in the street, and it'll be like, Oh, what is up, Ice Fang? And you're just like, Oh, hey. Or like, What's up, Stormblade? And you're like, Oh, hey, you gave me cooler names than like, Leggett Carl or something. It's retarded how dumb the Imperial names for uh, rankings. Like, even, even Battlefield 3, it's multiplayer. It's like, I would like to be a Colonel Grade 2 instead of like Legget Spunk Master 504. I don't know. Something weird. But yeah, I'm out of stamina. But I don't think I'm going to do that now. So where are the people that I have to kill? them let's report back to them. there yet because our fast travel to dawn I almost started walking that whole way that would have been kind of bad Ashon. of Solstheim is located northeast of Skyrim. Oh, it went away. Okay, so I'm gonna stop narrating for you now. Oh, hey, it's my vampire sister. Vampire. Vampire chicks look really cool with their face covered in the Dark Brotherhood. It looks very nice. So now I have to go kill this guy. Might be kind of hard because I'm only level 24. I'm used to my archer now. I know he's a low level still. I know there are people that have hit level 81 that are maxed out that have all your perks set. I don't play this game that much. State your business. That's why I'm only level. 24 with this character. Oh, hey, here's the courier. And then level 56 with my other character, because I don't play a lot. But I'm used to just walking up and crossbowing people or archery. I'm used to archery. So this might be a little weird. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like that's it. Got to go. So. You cannot escape the truth. You cannot escape the true Dragonborn. You there. So, the courier came and the cult is came. So, when Lord Mirak appears, all shall be. It just gave me hearth fire and. Oh, hello. It gave me my hearth fire and my dragonborn gubbins. Search by Tilled, Gold, the key to a house, a lockpick, and a silver amethyst. Wunderbar. I mean, wonderful. Ah, why are the Imperial soldiers attacking me? Did they know I killed that one chick?
Ah, uh, son of a gun. I am stuck on a fence. This is not good. Alrighty, I'm no longer stuck on that dumb fence. Attacking the cultist. Please, please, whatever you do, do not kill me. I am friendly. I only wish to steal your life forces because, yeah. Cultist orders, robes, mask, glove, and boots. Well, the steel. And I can't run. How much gubbins do I need to get rid of? Uh, papa, amulet of... Amulet of bats. While wearing this amulet of bats, I'll drink nearby enemy. Gargo. Three seconds. Summons an additional gargoyle for three. Man, see, I haven't played the vampire in so long that I don't remember exactly what she does. Throw veil. Gloves of the pugilist. Some strikes do ten additional damage. I'm going to be destroying those soon. Enchantment. I tried to get this lady in the archery, but. Haven't quite done that yet. Ring this, you will receive 100 extra health, and your claw attacks will do an additional 20 damage. Ring of the Erudite will 100 extra magicka, as well as ring faster. Okay, so if you wear the ring and necklace at the same time, it should combine power. The band of matrimony, I'm married. Okay, I'm checking what I have just in case. And it looks like they're still shooting bow and arrows at me. Oh, they're still shooting bow and arrows at me. Ah, and this dude is still attacking me. Get out of here. Ah, ain't nobody got time for that. Fuck. Okay, well, I'm dead. Fuck being level 24, by the way. Kind of sucks. Ah, I wish I wouldn't have been attacked by everything in that one dumb city. I hate you, Dawnstar. You're now my least. I'm sorry. On this account. On my other account, that the new Dark Brotherhood thing. Be mad at ya. Also, earlier in the comments, somebody had asked about some spells and if they were fixed location and if you could get the conjure seeker um with that this is for the dragonborn dlc with that um a lot of the spells you can get um ash shell ash shell um oh hell where am i you can get ash shell you can get um ash rune so it's like the lightning rune, except it's with ashes. You can get Conjure Seeker. I found Conjure Seeker in the Apocrypha, but I haven't found any other spells there. Like, I think that's the only one you find in the Apocrypha, as far as I know. Because that's the only one I had found there. Um, so yeah, that one is the only one I found there. But with, like, Ash Shell, Ash Rune, uh, Conjure, Ash Spawn, and Conjure... Ash Guardian. There's a couple like new spells and then the Bound Bow of course. There's a couple of new or was it Bound Bow or Bound Dagger? Bound Dagger is the one that they just added because there's Battle Axe, Sword and Bow, Bound Dagger. But those spells you can all find in Tell Mithrin. Um on my map yet? No. So when you go to Solstheim, um if you're looking down on Solstheim from the top, you land in the port over here, and I know this is still Skyrim, I'm sorry, but I haven't got to tell Mithrin yet. Um, if you look, you get here on the port, Tell Mithrin is over here, just directly to the opposite end. It's this giant mushroom. It's really hard to miss. It's on the other side of the island, um, near the bottom of the island as well. So, if you go to Tell Mithrin, you'll be able to find all those spells. Um, do I still have... It saved my notes. I'm hoping it saved my notes so I don't have to back into some stupid. I don't think it 
did. Yeah, didn't start it yet. So we're gonna travel to White Run. This is the city I go to the most in this game, surprisingly. Like, even though I have my house in Solstheim and my house in Riften and my house is wherever the hell else and all the other holds, um, I still go to White Run a lot. My dumb first house there has a lot of good gubbins in it. And it, when I say gubbins, if you know who Rooster Teeth is, you know Gavin, of course, if, or Achievement Hunters. You know Gavin, the crazy British guy that everybody either loves or hates. That's his word for stuff. So the British equivalent of stuff is gubbins, and so that's what I've been saying lately. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I use it to say stuff because it's Gavin Free. He's awesome. You Rooster dead. Teeth, and I hope You're to work one there one day. Dragonborn. Yes, I am the one they call Dragonborn. What do you want from me? Your lies fall on deaf ears, Deceiver. The true Dragonborn, Dragonborn comes. comes. You are but, but his shadow. Okay, cultist. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear. I've been looking for you. Time to die. Ah, uh, now is not the time, courier. Get me out of here, Jesus. I like how the courier is just like, hey, now's a good time to tell you you're fucked. It's like, oh, okay, well. And this cultist is getting destroyed by all the townspeople. Wonderful. So they help me. She's got blister warts and gold. So together. You look tired, friend. I've been looking for you. Thank you. Now deliver this cubbins. Oh, there's a new lady. Ah, um, looks like that's it. Hearthfire and a Jarl. So that's Hearthfire's star right there. And this was Dragonborn star. So now we have officially started Dragonborn. Um, Spell Tome. I'm going to take that from him. I don't like scrolls a whole lot because they're one-time use. I like to learn a spell and then have it from then on. Um, oh, I'm kidding. I like to have a spell and just know it from then on. It's nice every once in a while having scrolls because scrolls are a lot of the time more powerful than regular spells, but you know, beggars can't be. If you need potions, you Let's see. That's not my house. Did I put anything in this house? Put anything of importance in my house. Because I am a vampire. I live somewhere else besides this house. Yeah, this house isn't even built. Jeezy Pete's that house is empty. Okay, well. Didn't build anything in that house, everybody. Just so you know. So, it looks like Dragonborn has started. So for the next few minutes, I will be starting the Dragonborn DLC and trying to provide more dumb, funny comedy entertainment gubbins for you. In. Nope. Sorry. Um, I'm Dragonborn, read the cultist orders. Okay, it's in my... Pocket. I haven't read it yet. Cultist. Board the vessel, Northern Mate. Doctor Ray. Kill the false dragonborn, known as Brit Ewan. Reaches Solstice. With word of your success. Okay, well, that was their order. Dark Brotherhood. There's a note from the Dark Brotherhood that I had just found for the first time the other day. And it's a black hand. This one. I believe. It is a black hand that says, we know. I freaking love that. And I know there's, like, shirt up and everything. That is freaking dope. The first time I found that, I was like, whoa. Hello. I, I don't know what you want from me. So we are going to travel. Oh, cool. There's a stable right there. So we're going to Solstheim now. 
and we are going to take care of this old dragonborn gubbins. Going to get rid of that dragonborns. So I'm I'm rambling on. I just woke up literally like half an hour ago. It's two o'clock in the afternoon. I don't work until five o'clock for the first few days of the week, and the other days of the week I work 14-hour shifts. So it's like I sleep all day Sunday, or I beat Dead Space 3 all day Sunday, and then I sleep really long Monday morning, and then I get up and I make a video for you. Oh, and hopefully, okay, so tomorrow I'm going to head to my bank, going to withdraw some money, I'm going to get myself some food, that part doesn't matter. I'm going to hopefully be going to, if they have a midnight release, of, you have committed crimes against Skyrim. oh shit, of Bioshock Infinite, and then I'll be bringing you videos on it. Look at how much bounty I have. I don't even think I have that much gold to give this dude. I guess you're smarter than you So I'm just going to go to jail for a bit. Going to escape. I don't know all of which jails are escapable on here, but I do know a lot of them are. You can escape them. Um, if you're good enough at lockpicking, they leave you a lockpick. And then your ragged clothing. But they will leave you a lockpick. And you can try to pick the lock on here. What I've done before is crouch down, wait for a guard to pass, and I've actually pickpocketed the keys off the guards. That one is really funny to do. The guards are kind of just like, what? What's going on? They don't even know you took the key from them, usually. And then you just walk your way out, and they're like, hey, wait. Aren't you supposed to be in that cell? And you're like, uh, no. Okay, so right now... Vampiric Dream. Um, I don't remember what spells I have anymore with this chick. Sword, Fire Breath, Healing. Those are all my favorite ones. Vampire Lord, so I have that still. Conjuration. I need to start. Oh, I need to get. A Necromant. Healing. Kinda dead. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Powers, dragon skin, I'm a Breton. Vampire servant, vampire sight. Vampire lord, so I still have that active. Champion of the night, Luke. Vampire, more powerful, knight. footstep. Resist frost, resist magic, resist poison. The warrior stone and weakness to fire. Fire is no. So illusion of spells are cast 25% better, but I don't want to use. This chick, I am a one-handed pro. <coughs> oh, he's already caught me pickpocketing. Well, there goes my one lock pick on that adept lock. So I am just going to sleep this one off. Do you want to serve your time in jail? Yes. Because then I won't have to pay a lot of monies that I don't have. Yes, bad grammar. I know, sometimes I use the bad grammar to say things more funnier. It's just how I speak. Um, if any of you listen to the Comedy Button podcast, um, Anthony Gallegos... He's one of the editors for IGN, you may know him from there, but he did a really funny Hispanic impression the last week, and he is Hispanic, but he sounds totally American. It's like me, I'm half black and I sound totally American. People. Ugh. No, it was good. But he does this really funny Hispanic voice impression, and it's talking about going to the DMV and getting a license. Oh! 
My powers grow as I hunger. Vampire seduction added. To bite. Oh, I might get nervous. A woman approaches with her weapon drawn. Yes, you should be nervous when I approach with my weapon drawn. You should be more nervous when I approach with nothing drawn. Because that means I'm probably about to turn into a vampire lord and eat your face off. It's just something I do. Nothing against you personally. It's just something I do. Um, I don't know how long you guys want these Let's Plays. Um, my preferred Let's Play length... Like, I watch a lot of channels between Rooster Teeth and then the personal channels of some of the people that work there. But usually about a half hour to 40 minutes is a nice time. Usually when I'm first starting to watch videos, I'll grab some food, I'll sit down, I'll eat for like half hour, 40 minutes. And then I call it good. I'll either play another game or continue watching Let's Plays afterwards. So I'm going to make this one about half hour long. Um... If you guys want them to be longer, let me know. If you want them to be shorter, let me know. I'll work with those accordingly. Um, yeah, I have to. Okay, there's water down there. Um, if any of you saw the Azadol's Armor video I made, I know that one's kind of the most popular one right now, but you have the water walking boots that are kind of glitched. They let you jump down in a deep things of water from a very high distance without getting hurt um, I don't know I don't have them right now because I haven't got to soul time yet but I'm wondering if that was ever patched and I'll definitely be trying it later I'll probably try jump jumping oh where's it I'll probably try jumping off something really tall and finding out if they work or not and there's a dragon behind me I'm gonna deal with him gonna make me fight him eventually though how do I get up on here maybe I can get up from here. Uh, uh, yep I could okay so there's a dragon around here um, not too keen on fighting him right now ah I'm bad with fire and that's a fire dragon okay so that dude isn't going nowhere He's skirt out of his boots. What time is it? Why can I not move? I can't wait when enemies are nearby, so I can't check what time it is in the imaginary land of uh, Skyrim right now. Uh, duh, duh, duh. Weapons. Poor sword. I'm not a very good archer with this chick. That's what my other account was for, is archery. And especially since right now I don't even have, uh... Stamina. Is that Saran? I don't want to shoot Saran in the face, but... Will if I have to. Just kidding, I won't really. Uh, ba 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 looks like... Okay, so I don't know if that's gone or if it's... Especially effective against undead like myself. So I'm going to say it's safe to assume that thing is gone, which probably isn't. Okay, it flew off into the distance. So maybe now I'll be able to talk to B -B 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 Buster over here. If you're looking for passage to so Stein. Too bad. I'm going not back going there back anymore. anymore. Kind of sucks. You're going to have to. Be at your back, friend. <sighs> sure. Yeah, that's. Now hold on. That was it's hard. The next thing I rem there's been something strange. Have you been listening to me? I'm not going back there. Oh, you have a call. Besides, huh? Yay, we're going to Soul's time. So Dragonborn officially started at the near the end of this episode. Got another couple seconds. So I'll probably land in Sils time, do some dumb spinny knifing in the air, Call of Duty style, and conclude this Let's Play. But it was fun. I'll definitely be doing more Let's Plays soon. Um, you know, 
to Let's Play. And I'll be getting this put up on my channel today, of course, because, well, I don't have anything to do for the next few hours, and because that's sort of... I think that should be video etiquette. If it's recorded that day, it should be put up that day, so you don't well, forget about it. here we are. This is Raven Rock. Raven Rock. I say I'm all that glad to, to see, see it again. Well, he's not glad to see Raven Rock, but I am, because that means... I have officially started the Dragonborn DLC, and I don't know how well this is going to end, because with my level 56 archer dude, he has like no hand-to-hand -hand experience, so two-handed, one-handed, he's kind of a little bitch with those, and so Mirak cut my head off the first time, so I'm not quite sure how this will all work. Um, frozen. Shout out to uh I don't recognize you. So I'll assume What's his name? I used to work with him and I don't remember his name anymore, but he just got online. You picked one of the worst pick? Just remember. Any questions? Nope, I have no questions for you. Raven Rock started Oh stop talking to me, please. I need to go! I need to stop this conversation. Stop it! Stop it! Remember, we're watching you. Okay. Well, there's not much to see. I'm a vampire who's uh, damaged by the sunlight and, you know, in your city. But anyways, that was part one of this wonderful Let's Play. I hate how the... Polygons on your nose are showing. Move them. Get them gone. I took 3D. That's what I'll be going to school for is video game animation and design. So things like that do really bug me in video games. Finding glitches or seeing that someone's nose still has like geometry on it. But anyways, this was part one of the Skyrim Dragonborn Let's Play. Uh, look forward to part two. You know what? Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. Maybe I'll do these... Yeah daily if I'm not working or busy otherwise. So that was part one. This is Harkin Sword and that is my left hand with Vampiric Drain. This is Afro Ninja signing out ladies. Goodbye. Have a nice day and remember Canada.